Hey guys, do you guys like me like on the side of the room? Should I be centered? I feel like I should be centered. 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 Then you see all the crap over there because I kind of like use this to like be neat. And then this is like where I push all the crap. So it's like, oh, so nice. She's so neat and creative. What the crap? What the crap is that? What is that? All that crap. Ignore the box. Just ignore it, okay? Just ignore the box. Okay, so, hi guys. I am back with the new tutorial and it's a duo. So, duo, does that make sense? It's a hair tutorial and a makeup tutorial. It's gonna be this two tutorial. It's gonna be this tutorial. It's gonna be this makeup here. It's a chocolatey brown smoky eye with like a pink nude lip and I've been really obsessing over those of colors new lip matte liquid matte lipstick uh, in stone and I've been wearing it almost every day and I just like, love it and you guys I've been posting it on Instagram a lot and you guys have seen it and you're like why do you do a tutorial and I'm like yes I'm going to Miami this week and I just wanted to make sure that I have a video for you guys so I decided to do a double whammy sure um and yeah so I'm gonna teach you how to get this look. It's very chocolatey and smoky and smultry. It's smultry. It's sultry. It's a really pretty smoky chocolate eye. I actually saw it on Jacqueline Hill's Snapchat a while ago. She and she said like what she used, so I decided to recreate it for you guys. Um, and I decided to do a hair tutorial. This is waves. <laughs> Like this is my favorite hairstyle right now. It's beachy 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 waves. Okay, beachy waves. It's really really beachy waves. Um, so you guys can use this for prom. I feel like this this is a really easy kind of sexy sultry tutorial for prom. You can use it. I feel like the hair is super easy. It took me like maybe 20 minutes, maybe 15. To get this look, I use the Bellamy 6-in-1 Curler and I'm obsessed with it. I use the biggest one that comes in that package. I forgot how many inches it is, but it's the biggest one. And um, I am obsessed with it. I colored my hair, if you can't see. Uh, I am doing a process of going lighter. I'm keeping my dark roots though, because I just feel like it would just be like too much to go light. And I've seen Khloe Kardashian recently and she looks so pretty with light hair, but I have dark eyes so I feel like I don't think I'll pull it off. So, I don't know. I just figured it would be different for summer. I haven't gone white in a really long time so I figured it'd be nice. So I'm starting off with caramel and then I'm going to be going into like a ashier kind of blonde, beachy blonde, kind of Jessica Bersiaka inspired. So we'll see how that goes. Hopefully it goes well. So, and I would just like to say that I am so thankful for all of the likes and the love and the likes and the love. I'm so thankful for all of the love on Instagram and YouTube. I am so happy every day to see your guys' comments and your feedback and love and all that kind of stuff because you guys like make my day, like totally make my life, like seriously. Well, yeah, I think that's it, and I will see you guys next time. Make sure to thumbs up this video if you like it, and subscribe if you want to see more of my crazy face. So I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys. So I'm going to be using the Too Faced Shadow Insurance to prime my eyes, and starting with a 224 from MAC, I'm blending in soft brown into my crease. Taking saddle with the same brush, going back into my crease to bring more depth. Grabbing Embarked with a 239 from MAC, I'm going to be placing this on my lid. I'm also going to be using a fluffy brush to blend this into my crease as well. And after that, I'm going to be taking the same 239 and taking M100 from Makeup Forever and blending that on my lower lid. Now for liner, I'm going to be using Kat Von D's Tattoo Liner and doing a simple wing.
favorite mascara at the moment is Too Faced Better Than Sex, and I'm going to be coating my lashes with that. And we're going to be also adding lashes. These are Iconic by House of Lashes. I'm using Duo Glue to apply these with a tweezer. I am obsessed with these lashes, like, obsessed. I'm gonna be lining that, and now I'm gonna be taking NARS Larger Than Life Longwear Liner and just lining my waterline. Taking a pencil brush from Makeup Diction Cosmetics, I'm going to be blending Embark and M100 on the lower lash line. And applying mascara yet again. I'm going to be using Brow Wiz by Anastasia Beverly Hills to fill in my brows. This is in soft brown. I'm also going to be adding Dip Brow Pomade in chocolate to fill them in even more. And I'm going to be concealing them with a MAC concealer and setting them with Anastasia's Clear Brow Gel. And your eyes are complete. Moving on to the face, I'm going to be taking MAC Modern Mandarin and a fluffy brush from Sephora and adding this to my cheeks. I'm now grabbing Artist Couture by Mac Daddy or Angel Marino. I'm grabbing the Diamond Glow Powder in Gold Digger and a Morphe brush to highlight my cheekbones, my nose, my cupid's bow, my brows, my chin, and my in, like in flower face because I like to glow like a disco ball. So yes, this is a super gorgeous powder. I'm obsessed right now. Moving on to lips, I'm going to be using MAC Whirl Liner and I'm going to also overline a tad because that's my new obsession since Kylie made it one. So I'm going to be overlining them and adding one of my favorite lip colors right now which is Dose of Colors in Stone and this is stunning. I literally wear it every day. I am obsessed like everything else. So yes, I'm going to be applying this now. This color is just everything. It's just perfect in every way. I'm obsessed. And I probably said obsessed like too many times. But really, it's beautiful. Love it. Now I'm trying to just get the all-nighter spray by Urban Decay to work and I'm just messing everything up. But whatever. Now it's time to do that her. So I'm going to be using the Bellamy 6-in-1 wand and I'm going to be sectioning my hair to two sections just so I can kind of keep it organized. So after you've sectioned I'm going to be getting the wand on and then I'm going to curl away from my face, and then the next curl will be towards my face, and the next curl will be away again. So I have a mix of curls so that my hair will be a little bit more voluminous. But yes, I'm obsessed with this curler. I can't stop saying obsessed, but whatever. I love this curler right now. Especially with all the wands that it comes with, you can get so many different looks, and I love that. It's just so easy, and I feel like with traveling, it's just going to be a dream but I just love the beachy waves that I get out of this with the big wand. taking my favorite spray right now. This is Paul Mitchell Soft Style Super Clean Light Spray and I'm going to be going through my hair and kind of scrunching it up and sprucing it a little bit just so it has some kind of bounce. I love the spray. It's so flexible and I just love that dance as well. I'm going to be taking more sections and doing the same thing. So here we go. Mm -hmm.
Now for the top sections of the hair, I'm going to be putting all of the hair away from my face so it just has a nice kind of flow. I don't like when it's too curled in because then it'll be too old Hollywood. I want this to be more of a beachy look, so I'm putting everything away from my face. Now after the last curl, just run your fingers through it, scrunch it up, play with it, flip it upside down, whatever you feel like doing. I'm just going to be adding more Flexible Hairspray by Paul Mitchell and scrunching it and sprucing it up. Add in some more volume. Mm -hmm. Trying not to spray my eyes well. Mm -hmm. If you wanted to get real big with your hair, you could take a wide tooth comb and just pull up the ends and make it a little bit bigger. I love this look as well. I know Khloe Kardashian does this a lot with her hair and it just looks amazing. So, yeah, I love this. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this tutorial, this double whammy, and I will see you guys next time. Bye. Alright, stop being so sassy. See you later. <laughs> What's up? I'm gonna move this way. That's good. Right? Right? Maybe. I don't know what to do. Why am I like having problems right now? <coughs> I'm dying, dying, dying. With a blue undertone, so it has that pearlescent kind of iridescent color. This thing's stunning, especially for summer, like honey mermaid. I got the con.